Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. Yesterday, I let you know that the latest game-ready driver, NVIDIA driver 576.02, is still causing plenty of problems despite the driver package being packed with bug fixes. And as I mentioned in the video, which will be linked down below and in the end screen, the latest game-ready driver is causing black screens again and the wrong temps. Now, just to let you know that if you were affected by these issues, and I know a lot of you are because I've seen the comments, NVIDIA has now released a new hotfix driver that according to NVIDIA fixes the issue. Now, just a quick recap as to what a hotfix is in case you're unaware. According to NVIDIA, the GeForce hotfix driver is its way to try to get some of these fixes out to you more quickly. And they mentioned that these drivers are basically the same as the previous released version with a small number of additional targeted fixes. So that's basically the difference between a normal driver and a hotfix driver. Now, if we just head over to the release notes and the download location for the driver version 576.15, it's based on the previous driver package, as mentioned, version 576.02, which um, broke the temperature reading, as I mentioned yesterday. Now, according to NVIDIA, the problem occurred after the PC woke up from the sleep state, and that's when it would give the wrong temperature readings. And if we have a closer look at the hotfix um, release notes, here we can see that NVIDIA says GPU monitoring utilities may stop reporting the GPU temperature after PC wakes from sleep. So according to NVIDIA, this hotfix should resolve that issue. And then something else is that resume from modern standby can result in black screen. Now, modern standby and sleep could be related. So it could be that both the temperatures and the black screen are related. So according to NVIDIA, this hotfix should be resolving those issues. And over and above those two issues, the driver also fixes some other um, bugs like uh, shadow flickering corruption after updating to GRD 576.02, game ready driver. And there's also crashes on GeForce RTX 50 series graphics card when entering random mode. That's also been fixed. So if you were experiencing issues with the previous driver 576.02, then try this driver out. And as I mentioned with drivers, only download drivers, the latest driver, if you are experiencing any issues with your system or if it provides a relevant feature upgrade. Else just ignore the latest drivers because I see in the comments all the time and in my experience, the latest and greatest driver um, does not always fix issues. It can actually cause issues if it's not really needed by your system. So always keep that in mind. And if you want the download link, you can just click here. And that will download the latest driver package for Windows 10 and Windows 11 576.15 down to your system, where obviously you can get to that and install it onto your NVIDIA-based operating system. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.